Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. I hope everybody's well. Alright, we are kicking off the weekly reading for December 24th through the 30th. It's a little different this week because of the Christmas holiday. I don't plan on reading any cards on the 24th and 25th because of the Christmas holiday. I... I try really hard to spend that time with my family so yeah we'll see how that goes I may end up having to sneak off and throw down some cards for an hour or two to get caught up by the end of the year because sometimes um, depending on how early we wake up on Christmas morning there's a couple hour gap in there where Christmas Day involves a nap time so we'll just see how things go anyway Friends, we're going through all 12 zodiac signs today. Hopefully, it doesn't take like two and a half hours. Six of Pentacles came out for somebody. We'll see who it comes back out for. Possibly an equal give and take situation. Possibly things coming back into balance. All right. Resonates with your sun sign. Cool. If not, check them in rising your Venus placement. Just keep in mind time and energy are both fluid. So, just because I'm asking. For events for a specific week does not mean necessarily that's when it plays out. Could have already played out. Could be about to play out. You know the drill. Can play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. Cross watchers are always welcome here at my table. Everybody's always welcome at my table. If you're new here and think we're going to vibe and stuff, you can hit the subscribe on the notification bell. That'd be super cool of you. If you're returning, welcome back. It's nice to see a familiar face. I have turned comments back on, so as long as people aren't being a jerk in my comments and saying unnecessary things, and I don't have to block anybody from watching my channel, I will keep the comments engaged for you guys, okay? Alrighty. Well, what else? What else? What else? What else? Anybody can hit the like button at any time. It all helps the channel. It all helps the messages to be circulated to those who may need them. So let's invoke the cards and start throwing them down for our signs. We'll be reading with the wizards, clarifying with Rider Waits. Additional advice will come from the Moonology and the Wisdom Oracle. Okay, here we go. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for the collective this week. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me today. I appreciate you grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given and I ask that you help me use it to bring the collective to their highest possible spiritual good put them on their highest possible spiritual path okay all right friends Capricorn what do we have for you this week what do we have for you this week okay really Page of Wands, Four of Wands. Fiery messages is a new opportunity. Doors opening, possibly. Let's see if they come back out. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Knight of Wands. Hmm. I don't like it. I'm going to throw the rest of the cards down before I say anything else. So far, I'm not liking this. Tower of the Seven of Swords and the Star Reversed. Yeah, I'm not liking this at all. Hmm. Venus is currently in retrograde. We're about to hit Mercury retrograde pre-shadow. Hmm, I don't like it at all. Queen of Wands, Strength, Page of Swords, 
So, so far, Aquarius, Scorpio, Leo, air energy, fire energy, a little bit of earth, but that's not steady earth. That's not strong. I don't like that Queen of Pentacles reversed. Why are you feeling like that? Okay, Wheel of Fortune. And the f okay. Things will be looking up. King of Wands reversed. Right now you feel like stuff is stagnant, not moving. Probably have a little bit of a low self-esteem thing going on. Probably has something to do with someone or something constantly coming in and out of your life. I feel like shocking return possibly something you hadn't healed from in the past I feel like an old I feel like an old wounds about to be ripped open Eight of Pentacles, three of Cups. Putting them back. <coughs> I feel like there may have been an investment and effort put into something that was third party. Possibly. There's secrets here. Someone's carrying knowledge deep down in the depths. dropping secrets along the way. Talk to me about this Knight of Wands. One card. Lovers. Oh shit. Twin flame, divine match, if that's your sort of thing. Soulmate card. Soulmate card. So whatever events are about to play out is happening for a reason. Just keep that in mind. Just keep that in mind. There's a closeout and a new start coming. So just because things aren't moving now doesn't mean they won't. Give me one on this tower. One on this tower. Okay, I'll take two. Justice and temperance. The universe is about to move something out of your life to restore balance and tranquility. <laughs> this is good stuff. This is good stuff. So, whatever is about to happen, it's supposed to. It's going to feel like a calamity. Probably going to be a shock, but it's supposed to. Because it's going to bring in this. Talk to me about Seven of Swords. Talk to me about Seven of Swords. Oh. 
harboring some sick keeping things to themselves. You be could you be keeping things to yourself? The you may never know why. The enter the bombshell, the quick exit. Somebody is about to go total hermit. Whoa. All right. Okay. Star reversed. Star reversed. King of Cups. Hmm. Wow. Whoa, Capricorn. All I have to say is whoa. Okay. Nine of Wands. Walls going up. The tower is bringing in justice and tranquility and peace. It is not going to feel like it in the moment. As general as humanly possible. One on this Queen of Wands. We're going to talk about why it happened. One on the Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands, Five of Pentacles. Why strength? Four of Pentacles reversed. Why Page of Swords? Three of Cups. Okay. God, I was afraid of that. That's wh that's why. That's why you're feeling so low. I ain't gonna lie. This is about booty. Somebody only wanted one thing. And once they got it, they bounced. The strength card, sometimes it takes more strength to let go than it does to hang on, believe it or not. I think you let it go. And then they came back in with the truth. Sometimes the page of wands tell you, you things you do not want to hear. Third party situation. It may have been a long period of silence. I think this person comes in and out. Leaves you stuck. Stuck emotionally. Stuck physically. Let me one on this Wheel of Fortune. Queen of Cups, Empress, Knight of Swords. Nice. Nice. Something is about to come to an end, so something can start. This is something you can pour your heart into. This is something with the potential of growth. Give me one on this Knight of Swords, please. One on the Knight of Swords, please. Page of Swords. It's going to be quick, and it's going to be true. 
Could be an air sign. Make or break is the fool being willing to jump, trusting your judgment again. Strength. Strength and trusting your judgment. One more. Seven of Wands taking charge, battling your demons. Being combative against the things you need to be combative of, so watch out for the red flags, but don't be so combative that your walls stay up permanently and you don't let anybody in. Five of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Ultimately, you need to process the emotions that went along with whatever this was. Pick up the cups, cross the river, move forward. Don't sit, don't stand there and stare at those spilled cups. It's not going to do you any good. This tower is going to move for a reason. Probably has something to do with this. Don't stand there in the rubble. Don't stand there in the rubble. And accept that you may never know the truth about what happened. You will heal from this. It's just going to take time. All right. Give me a moonology. What does the moon have to say? What does the moon have to say? A time for healing. We'll all be damned. It is a time for healing. Give me a wisdom oracle. Poised. Number 48. Being ready, bringing something to light. Being at your best. Confidence. When you're confident and happy in your own skin, you're ready for deeper, more intimate relationships. You have nothing to prove right now. You're completely yourself and can handle anything. Love, friendships, harmonious new connections are all present now or are coming in. You're ready to give and receive from the heart. This is a beautiful place to be. But you have to get there. But you have to heal. You're going to get there. It's only going to suck for a little bit. You just got to keep that in mind, guys. Okay. I'm going to pause, clear for the next sign. All right, Aquarius, what do we have for you for the next week? Quick shuffle. Page of Wands, High Priestess, Reverse. Could be communication coming in. Someone may be fighting their intuition or perhaps have a little bit of a wounded ego. We'll see if anything comes back out. Pentacles are verse three of swords. Oh. <sighs> Nursing a broken heart. Things aren't going well right now, are they? Could be a family situation, could be a home or job situation with this Ten of Pentacles. Six of Wands, Six of Pentacles, Empress Reversed.
I have a sword reversed bottom of the deck. Feeling of defeat. Possibly some shady stuff going on behind closed doors. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Six of Wands. That's a card of return, guys. Can be. Or just someone being noticed. It's the look at me card. Judgment reversed. Look at me, did you change your mind yet? Page of Swords reversed. I don't even think they're saying anything. But I feel like they may have watched you for a minute. Peeking at your social media. Waiting for a moment. Feeling random Christmas card, maybe. Random Merry Christmas or happy whatever winter holiday you celebrate text. Could be kind of out of the blue. Talk to me about the Six of Pentacles. Knight of Swords reversed. Nine of Cups. Maybe you match the energy. Send a text back, but don't really say much. I'm feeling sensing being like, what do you mean I didn't block this person? Click. You're good. You're good on your own. You get on your own. You got nine cups here. Nine cups, six pentacles. You're balanced. You're good. And you're happy. Or you're good without this particular person. You're still nursing a broken heart here. But I, I'm feeling like you don't want to throw that particular band-aid on it. Why the Empress reversed? Why the Empress reversed? Hierophant reversed. You may feel like it's a missed opportunity. Something that had potential to grow that didn't. Or you know it didn't have the potential to grow and you don't want nothing to do with it. Some of you just maybe aren't ready for commitment or growth in anything because you're still healing and nursing a broken heart. Magician reversed. Queen of Wands reversed. I'm putting these back, but I'll throw this out there. Some of you might be a little bit jaded, not really uh, wanting to put up with anybody's puppet strings, not wanting to deal with the emotional manipulation and BS, and that's okay. One of the Queen of Cups reversed. One of the Queen of Cups reversed. Just one. Knight of Pentacles. It was an offer, but it was slow moving. Two of Wands reverse. So we couldn't make a decision. So we decided not to invest the time, energy, or patience into the wait. Because the emotion wasn't there. Something didn't get started. Ace of Swords reversed. Give me something on this Ace of Swords reversed. Oh, hi! Star in the upright.
Wow, those rider weights fly, don't they? Ten of Pentacles reversed. Something did not get started because you were in a process of healing because you were not ready. You were still healing from a family situation or they were, somebody was. Somebody was still healing from the loss of a job or the loss of a home or the loss of a family situation or a structure. Somebody needed to be alone for a while. Nine of Pentacles. One of those Nine of Pentacles. The lovers. Queen Wands reversed. I would rather be single. I don't want to chase nobody and please nobody chase me. Dang. How long are you going to nurse that broken heart, baby? How long are you going to nurse that? Let's just say some pentacles. There's a planted seed that's getting ready to grow, y'all. Five of Swords. Five of Swords. Strength reversed. But you got to fight for what you want when you want it and not hold back from it. Ace of Pentacles reversed. Nine of Wands, or Eight of Wands reversed. Page of Cups reversed. Magician reversed. If you want to see the sprout, you got to water it. You can't keep bringing everything to a dead stop. I'm hearing this, feeling this, sensing this. You can't. If you want it to manifest, you have to manifest it. You can't close yourself off from it. One of this page of cup or page of pentacles reversed. Swords reversed. I get it. You're still nursing a broken heart. I get it. I understand. How long are you going to nurse it? The moon reversed at the bottom of the deck. You have to allow clarity to come in. Give me a moonology. This has got dark. Mm. This may be for a specific person. A specific person may need to hear this. I try to keep these as general as possible. But I feel like someone has completely closed the door. Conclusions are within reach. Shady shit coming behind back doors. Someone was dishonest with you. You've been ripped apart in the past. 
clarity is within reach. Conclusions are within reach. But you have to come to them upon your own accord. It's okay to be single for a while. But if you want seeds to grow, you have to water them. The tribe, okay. Funny one to come out, but somebody needs it. It's number eight, card of infinity. Community, belonging, being seen and understood by others, like-minded connections, a sense of family and friendship, knowing your place in the world. You're discovering the essential qualities that you share with one another, and perhaps also those you don't share. There are times when you follow and the other person leads, and times when you lead and the other person follows. The appearance of this card points to the importance of learning the proper dance between you and another, accepting the truth that everyone has flaws is part of that dance. You are also being asked to be aware of the dynamics that you don't want to repeat. You're in a perfect place to make changes in order to experience the best version of who you can be together. Friends. Don't keep missing opportunities because you're afraid you're going to make the same mistakes. Don't close yourself off to it. Because it can be a beautiful, wonderful thing, but eventually you got to nurse this broken heart. Alright, I'm going to pause. Go on to the next sign. Okay, Pisces. Figure out where to cut. Okay, I think that'll work. Do, 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 do. There, that's better. Okay. Page of Cups reversed. We're going to see if that bad boy comes back out. Somebody's withholding. Somebody's watching from afar, maybe, not saying much. I don't know if it's you or the other person. I don't even know if it's going to come back out, but if it's your story, go ahead and take it. Is it really a good time to get back on the horse? You're sad. You understand what's going to happen if you get back on the horse right now, right? You got to dust off before you get back in the saddle. Just throwing that out there. Okay, Nine of Swords, Seven of Swords, Three of Cups reversed. Okay, Anxiety. I'm not saying anything else to get the rest of the cards on the table. Knight of Pentacles reversed, Wheel of Fortune. Okay. King of Wands reversed at the bottom of the deck. 
Things aren't moving forward right now. And they shouldn't be, because you need to dust off first. Whatever happened, tower, judgment reverse, justice happened for a reason. Talk to me about this tower. Talk to me about this tower for Pisces. Okay, the match didn't the match didn't strike. That's not necessarily a catastrophe, but okay. Oh. You put shit tons of effort into this and it still didn't go anywhere. Could have been Could have been work related, could have caused a little bit of work related drama. Okay. What about judgment reversed? Ten of Cups, reversed. King of Pentacles. Got it? King of Pentacles. Two of Swords reversed. Yeah, this happened for a reason. Justice. Page of Cups reversed. There it is. Okay. The universe stopped you from making a wrong decision. You're being protected. You need to keep this in mind. Talk to me about this Nine of Swords. Yeah, moving on is a little bit scary. Especially if you're still dusting off. Page of Swords. Magician reversed. I will say this. If you're moving on too soon and you're questioning like having full-blown anxiety as to whether someone's being truthful with you or not or if they're just pulling your puppet strings. They might just be pulling your strings. If you're questioning it, that's probably what's happening. <laughs> but you can't walk in assuming that they're just pulling puppet strings and nothing's going to manifest either. Seven of Swords. Two of Pentacles. Judgment. When on Judgment. Queen of Pentacles. Hmm. Hmm. 
They're just as anxious about you as you are about them. Am I good enough? Am I good enough? It's a matched pair. Hmm. It's very interesting. Why the three cups are versed? Your anxiety is going to get you. I'm telling you that right now. Your own anxiety is going to get you. You need to heal. If you try to move on, you both could possibly need to heal. Someone's watching from the far not saying anything. I don't know if it's the same person or not, but you may end up inadvertently manifesting a freaking trauma bond if you try to move into something too soon. You need time. I think you're going to come to the conclusion that you need time. Don't move, in, move into anything too slowly. A lot, okay. You don't have to. A relationship is not a requirement, for starters. Okay? It, 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 it is literally a repeat of trauma bonds if you pick up dust off and move on too soon. Okay? <laughs> Say it again. You need to heal before you move into anything. Knight of Pentacles reversed or allow things to remain stagnant until this cycle is over so something new can start. One on the page one on the Knight of Pentacles reversed. Eight of Swords until you come out of that state of anxiety and that little mental prison that you're in. Nothing's gonna work. Nine of Wands. Until you can lay your wands down comfortably and move into something new, you need to allow things to remain stagnant. The one on the Wheel of Fortune. Hairfant Reverse. Oh, wow. Seven of Swords, Five of Swords, Six of Cups. You're going to miss it. You're going to, you'll end up missing it. Wow.
You may miss the opportunity for the blessed union if you fail to learn this lesson. And it's going to be repeated the same old liar, cheater, jerk face BS. You're being protected until the right one comes along. Let me tell you that right now. When the right one comes along, you'll be able to let your wands down and come out of your cage and allow them to come in. But you need to allow yourself to heal first, honeys. Oh, hit the floor. Might be important. Talk to me. Confidence is key to your success. Well, I'll be darned. New moon in Leo. By the book. Speaking of the book, where's the book? There's the book. By the book. Eleven. Abiding by social rules, conformity, respecting culture, and family customs, universal laws. Okay. Oh my, you're getting the oracle message. It's a long one, but the oracle message is the one that uh, fits here, not the relationship message. You know, I might read them both. Yeah, no. The universe works within a structure of divine laws and principles that provides a framework for human experience and evolution. The law of abundance, the law of prayer, the law of karma, the law of attraction, the law of thought, the law of compensation, and the law of nature are only a few that are known. These principles create perfect order and operate with a kind of precision beyond human understanding. Even evolution has its place in law. Human beings, in turn, have their own laws and customs that vary from culture to culture and family to family. Laws keep social order and govern behavior, reflecting an instinctive understanding that harmony is important. This is a time to learn these laws and conform to them. Rather than being the rebel and flouting them. When this card appears, submit to structure and follow the rules, even if they may no sense <laughs> release resistance for universal laws will correct disharmony open your eyes to those universal laws and it will be easier to go by the book at this time law of attraction if you just want to get back on the horse, pick up dust off, move on, because you're sad. You're going to end up meeting someone who just wants to get back on the horse and pick up on dust off and move on because they're sad. Is that where you want to start a relationship with both of you being sad? That's not where you start a relationship at, guys. It's not. It's not. A low vibration is never a good place to start. I'm just throwing that out there, okay? Just throwing that out there. Because if you don't both elevate to that higher vibration at the same time, you're going to end up splitting off and splitting part in ways anyway. So it's best to just heal before you get back in the horse. I know you get getting antsy. I get that. I feel that. Give yourself some time, baby. All right. We're going to pause and move on to Aries. All right, Aries. What's happening with you guys this week? It's a lot of cards. King of Pentacles reversed was the tongue one on the top. Could be things not going so well with the job situation. Could not be feeling at your best, looking your best, being your best, doing your best. I don't know. We'll see if it comes back out.
Eight of Cups, Page of Swords at the split. Could be an honest conversation about somebody moving on coming up. I don't know. I don't know. What's going on, Aries? Star reversed. Emperor reversed. Huh. Shoot. Okay. Just keep it rolling. Strength. Queen of Swords. Three of Wands. Nine of Wands reversed, Nine of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Two of Wands. making the decision to let go of an old wand and move forward toward a new one. Because it's getting about time for the ships to be rolling in. There's three wands right there. Waiting on the ships. Hmm. Why is the Emperor reversed here? That was a quick answer to a wand. You're at crossroads. King of Pentacles was reversed is a lot like the Emperor reversed. Hanged Man Temperance. I'm putting him back. Could be a Pisces or a Sagittarius you're dealing with. Accepting the fate of a situation, not allowing yourself to be hung up in the gallows. Allowing things to flow as they're supposed to flow. You're getting ready to let something go. Something has knocked you off your horse. There's a lack of healing in a situation. There's a lack of wish fulfillment. Talk to me about strength. Lovers reversed. Taming an inner beast, possibly disconnecting from a soulmate connection, but it's going to remain burdensome. Why the Queen of Swords? Why the Queen of Swords for Aries? Thank you. Nine of Wands. Honest conversation time. Queen, King of Swords, Knight of Swords. Oh, man. That is one hell of an honest conversation. One more. Strength reversed. And no holding back.
Somebody's got to get something off the chest. I'm not a finger pointer. If it's not yours, leave it alone. Please leave it alone. Don't go accusing anybody of doing anything that shouldn't have been happening. If this is for someone specific, you know who you are. They're, they're about to be an honest conversation about things going down that should have been going down at some point. Empress. Could involve a pregnancy. Three of Wands. Talk to me about this Three of Wands. Okay. Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Star Reversed. Waiting on an answer. Are we investing more time? Can we rebuild after this? Can we ever heal from this? All right, talk to me about this. Nine of Wands Reversed. Talk to me about the Nine of Wands Reversed. This is a throwing in of the towel. Two of swords. Somebody made a difficult decision without any type of clarity to throw in a towel on a situation in the past. One on the nine of pentacles. Somebody just maybe decided that they wanted to be single or they felt single, but there was unfinished business to tend to. One on the five of swords. Oh, Aries. Oh, Aries. Seeds planted behind closed doors. <sighs> One more. Hermit. Could have been a Virgo. Okay. One more. One more for Aries. One more. I said one. We're going to take those. Leave this. Seven ones reversed. Avoidance of conflict. Never dealing with internal conflict. Walking a path. Is that five of swords again? someone tried to do the right thing tried to do the right thing the seeds have been sown all right talk to me about this ace of swords
Oh my gosh. Four of Wands. All right, there's gonna be a new start, but it could be painful. But doors are opening. Stability is coming. Why the Eight of Wands reversed? Returning to something that stopped moving? Six of Wands reversed, accepting defeat. Possibly something you haven't been paying attention to, or wasn't paying attention to you. Eight of Pentacles. Working on it. King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Returning to status. Returning to status. Whoa, I need a monology. Oh, honeys. Do we really have to end the year with trouble in paradise again, Aries? Whoa! Whoa! Mm. Confidence is key to your success. These hit the floor. I'm going to go ahead and take them. Hold your vision, look at the bigger picture, it's time to release negativity. New moon in Leo, full moon in Scorpio, fixed moon, full moon in Sagittarius. Pay attention to these. These could be important. Give me a wisdom. Some of you have a vision for what you want, but there's negative energy afoot and y'all need to look at the bigger picture. I feel like this has something to do with the family situation, guys. Poised in a change in the wind. Oh my God, we're already an hour into this. I'm going to be here a while. <laughs> it's okay though. Hopefully you guys can sit with me through this. A sense that unseen change has been initiated. Preparation for a storm. Awareness that your plans are not on firm ground. Feeling a shift. Uncertainty about which direction the winds will blow. Oh my. Who's feeling this, y'all? Relationships go through periods where partners seem out of sync with each other. And stormy emotions and moods threaten to take down the ship. Perhaps someone has a change of heart and leaves. These rough seas offer opportunities for mutual growth. A way for you to understand your own heart and to know what you need to be truly happy. Rest assured that whatever is happening now, good will come from it. Take tem temporary shelter and remove yourself from drama. The air will clear and everything will be fresh and new again. This too shall pass. Oh, Aries. 
If it's not yours, please leave it on the table. I don't want to cause problems for anybody. I don't want my cards causing problems for everybody. Poised, being ready, bringing something to light, being at your best, confidence. When you're confident and happy in your own skin, you're ready to, for deeper, more intimate relationships. You have nothing to prove right now. You're completely yourself and can handle anything. Love, relationships, harmonious new connections are all present now or are coming in. You're ready to give and receive from the heart. This is a beautiful place to be. Wow. Okay. All right, I'm going to pause and go on to Taurus. Okay, Taurus. What does the universe have for you this week? little buddy finally decided he wanted to wake up. Give me two seconds, guys. All right, Taurus, what you got going on? I'm going to try to fly out. Went back in my hand, though. All right, what's Taurus got going on? What's Taurus got going on? Oh. Queen of Cups, Upright, Lovers, Reverse. Some of you might be holding a cup for somebody that just don't feel the same way. Four of Pentacles reversed in the devil, trying like hell to let something go. But you are bound to it. Could be a little bit obsessed. Six of Cups reversed. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Three of Wands. Bad blood. Could be affecting a family situation. Three of Wands. Didn't Aries just get that same card? I don't know. Might have been Pisces, but I feel like it was Aries. Stay waiting. Two of Pentacles reversed, full reversed, Ace of Cups. <sighs> Somebody was juggling. Could have been a lack of trust in a situation. Ace of Cups. Okay. Four of Wands, Six of Swords, both reversed. Something's breaking down. Could be returning to something. Two of Cups reversed. Mm. Taurus, what is going on? Taurus, what is going on? Three swords reversed. I'm going to set that right there. Void and heartbreak. Why is the devil here? Moon reversed. Page of Pentacles. About to receive clarity. Possibly an offer of an apology. Seven of, seven of Pentacles. Somebody's waiting to apologize. Somebody's picking their moment. Probably waiting for things to become more clear about a situation. Why the Six of Cups reversed? Judgment. There's bad blood here. 
There's bad blood. Someone trying to resurrect something out of bad blood this month, week. Four of swords. But it's time to rest. Recuperate. Why the Ten of Pentacles reversed? Five of Cups. Ace of Cups. Sadness. Somebody wanting to start over. Okay. What three of wands? Why the three of wands? <coughs> Queen of Swords. Honest conversation. Emperor, Page of Cups reversed. Some y'all dealing with an Aries? Oh, snap. Withholding an apology or waiting for an apology, waiting for the right time to apologize. Oh, snap. One more on that. Give me one more. Three pebbles. Trying to rebuild. Why the two of pentacles for why it all happened? Why the two of pentacles? The world. Someone couldn't decide, someone was juggling, something came to an end. There's something new to begin. Ten of pentacles reversed, six of swords reversed. Tried to avoid the breakdown of a family, return to their family. Someone couldn't decide, someone was juggling. Why the four reversed? Return to avoid the breakdown of a family. This could have had to do something with work. Nine of Wands. Someone's walled off, someone was walled off. There was lack of trust, someone was walled off. Someone was combative. The sun, this had something to do with family. Ace of Cups, why the Ace of Cups? Two of Pentacles reversed. Juggling. Juggling. Oh, this is weird. This is weird. Don't go accusing your partner or whatever of things that didn't happen. If it isn't yours, leave it alone. Same thing I told Aries. Why the four of wands reversed? Empress. Closing a door. The emperor and his empress. King of Cups reversed. Closing the door because you can't give the emotion. Oh, 
Could have something to do with a husband-wife situation. Could have something to do with a pregnancy. But you gotta close the door on something, Taurus. Why the Six of Swords reversed? It's a card of return. Ten of Swords. The ending of a painful cycle soon as cycle can begin. This is going to be painful, but you have to do it. The devil. High priestess at the bottom of the deck. This is like soulmate as F. Toxic obsessions, intuition pulling people together, following your intuition, listening to your intuition. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I feel like something's going to try to creep back in when you're trying to fix something else. got to decide what you want to fix. Give me a moonology. A personal issue reaches resolution. Full moon in Cancer. Sounds like a very personal issue by the sounds of things. Okay. Give me a wisdom. Yin, number two. Two, the number of choices. The feminine principle of receptivity, letting someone else make the first move, gathering information and taking in cues, the art of conscious allowing. Let others take the lead right now. Your power lies in small gestures, soft awareness, and conscious surrender. By yielding the reins, you'll find yourself effortlessly moving closer to what you truly desire. Permit others to tell you who they are and who they can be to you by allowing their actions to speak about them. You'll be ple you will be pleasantly surprised. Okay, we're going to clear the decks and move on to Gemini. All right, Gemini. Ten of Cups popped out. Hmm. Family's getting back together. Could be a card of family. I mean, this is family time. Just around the corner. be a family situation or issue you gotta deal with. Alright, what's up? Page of Wands reversed in the chariot. Watching from afar issue hmm. travel, distance, gaps, forward I'm shutting up. Let's just get the cards on the table. Knight of Wands reversed at the bottom of the deck. Nobody's talking, nobody's communicated, nobody's moving. Holding off an ending. Three of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Somebody's holding off an ending. Give me clarity. Why the chariot? 
What's the chariot about? What's the chariot about? What's the chariot about? Shoot! Empress reversed. King of Cups. Pentacles reversed. Two kings. Very interesting. What is this? Like, War of the Roses crap? Is this a tale of two families? There's distance. Someone lost patience. Something couldn't grow. Someone couldn't invest, invest as much as the other. That's why something's not moving. The issue here is forward movement. Nothing's moving. Why the Ten of Swords reversed? High Priestess reversed. Something, something painful not coming to a conclusion. Wounded egos. Probably some backstabbing involved. Strength reversed. Hermit. Draining. Someone's drained. Someone needed some time. Put things back into balance. Decide what they wanted. Why the Wheel of Fortune reversed. Seven of Cups, confusion. Something not coming to a conclusion so something new can begin because someone can't decide what they want. Two of Cups, Nine of Cups. Am I okay by myself? Or do I want to join this union? What do I want? Could be like a social class difference here. I feel like someone is extremely materialistic and I feel like someone is very emotionally closed off. Something's not growing or moving because someone can't invest as much as the other, be it emotion or money or otherwise. Why the two of cups? Really? Okay. I'll bite. Ten of Pentacles, Six of Swords, Ace of Cups, Three of Pentacles. This has potential. It doesn't have the emotion. And I feel like someone's going to move on because it doesn't have the emotion. Feels extremely short lived. And I feel like other parties involved might be pulling some strings. There's three of pentacles there. There's another three of pentacles. Why this three of pentacles? Why does this... Okay. Why am I getting specifics for a weekly? I'm sorry. These are so specific. Either way, I feel like this is two families that don't get along whose kids are trying to hook up. Or maybe the kids are already hooked up. I don't know. This is like lifetime Christmas movie crap, guys. Okay.
Someone returned to try to build a foundation. The other person couldn't make up their mind or made a decision without enough clarity. Knight of Pentacles. That's a handsome offer. It got ignored, though. Four of Cups. Reverse. Nine of Wands. Maybe someone needed more time to consider. Things came in quickly. Wasn't the right time to take the cup. Wasn't the emotion in the cup. One more. <clears throat> Page of Swords. Shit. Oh, shit. That was an ass conversation, wasn't it? Why the five of swords? Why the five of swords? Why the five of swords? Queen of swords. Yeah, that was an ass conversation. Probably an avoidable one. And stuff was left unfinished. And that's where you ended up. Emperor. Why the Emperor is a conclusion. That's the Lord of the Manor, King of the Castle. That's all four kings combined. Hereford reversed. Knight of Wands reversed. Missed opportunity, nothing's moving. But you're Lord of the Manor, King of the Castle, you're the one in charge. And the one in, char one in charge should probably make decisions for his own life, for her own life, and not allow other people to do that. Five of Swords reversed. This gets, okay, this, <laughs> this is so soap opera, oh my gosh. You need to take charge. There's shady backdoor crap going on that you're not being let in on, and that's why things aren't moving. It's not coming together because other people aren't allowing it to come together, and they haven't been for a while. You need to decide who you're letting, who you're putting out in the cold and who you're letting back in. Why the Five of Pentacles reversed? Six of Pentacles reversed. Seven of Wands. Ten of Swords. There's lies and deception and shady crap that needs to come to an end so something that's meant to be together can come together. Growth is being stunted here, and I don't like that. I don't like that. Prosperity lies ahead. A new romantic cycle begins. That's awesome. I pulled two for you because you're Gemini. I love you guys. You know that. All right. Give me a wisdom oracle. Regeneration. That's a nice one. 
Number 46, 4 plus 6 is 10. 10 plus 0 is 1. 1 is the new beginning. Think this crap happens by accident, guys? Rebirth, second chances, new opportunities. The world is based on connections and relationships. No matter what loss has occurred in the past or even now, death and endings are only illusions. There is life after death, love after loss, and in this moment, you are radiating the regenerative life force energy that makes you irresistible to love in all forms. Now is the time when you will see evidence of this new emergence. Can you feel it? Love is rising up to greet you. Could be a second chance too. See how it goes. All right, I'm pausing. And we are moving on to Cancer. All right, Cancer, we're going to keep it going. There, I can grab my hand now. Cancer. Keep it rolling for Cancer. This is going to be a long one, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, four Pentacles reversed. Some of you, possibly. Letting something go. Maybe opening a door for new things to come in. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Three of Pentacles, Page of Cups. All right, here's the deal. There's a potential for a connection here. There's a potential for friendship. There's a potential for foundations. Nobody's talking. Nobody's extending the olive branch at this point, possibly. Somebody could be watching in silence. Maybe it's you. It's the challenge either way. The Fool, the Four of Cups, the Knight of Pentacles. Contemplating a cup. Ready to start over. Eight of Cups reversed, Four of Wands. There might be a return, but how long does that door stay open? Devil at the bottom of the deck. Someone might be coming out of some toxic crap, realizing they're doing some toxic crap, trying to pull away from it. Could you be separating from a Capricorn? I don't know. Hmm. 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 Talk to me about this Page of Cups. Oh, wow. That's why they're not talking. They're still a little bit combative. You're still a little bit combative. Maybe someone's dealing with some inner demons and that's why they're not talking or stopped talking. I feel like they can't talk. Why the fool? I mean, one on the fool. One on the fool for cancer. Okay, I'll take two. <clears throat> King of Swords. Will of Fortune reverse. There's unfinished business here. Someone's trying to be logical. Someone's trying to not make an, emo make an emotion based decision. One more on that. Three of Cups. Could be another party involved already. Possibly. Or you feel like there's another party involved. 
by the four cups. Empress. Hmm. They had a catch. Why the Empress? You're contemplating it. Queen of Pentacles. Yup. They're the catch. That's why you might feel like there's another birdie involved already, because they're definitely a catch. They're everything you wanted. But there's combative energy here, and that's why you're contemplating it so hard. There's been feuding. Why the Knight of Pentacles? Nine of Swords reversed. Okay, possibly the offer might be extended. Coming out of anxiety about it, willing to be patient with it, and a new start. Okay. Why did it all happen? Let's let's address that for a second. Three of Wands. Deep contemplation. Do I explore their options or do I return to this? Do I wait for the ship to come in or do I return to it? Mm. Possibly by the time you made a decision, Nine of Wands reversed. Let the walls down. They threw in the towel. Or you decided to throw in the towel, decided you just wanted to be single. Ten of Swords. Maybe you decided you needed a painful cycle to come to an end, or they did. Either way... Nobody's talking. There's no communication. There's no forward movement with it. Possibly communication got blocked. Knight of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. Ready to come up with that cup. Ready to offer that seed. Ten of Cups reversed, Ace of Cups. Eight of Cups. That feels like a too little too late. That feels a little too little too late. Because nobody's talking. Mm. Talk to me about this Eight of Cups. Six of Cups reversed, Eight of Cups reversed. There's bad blood here. I think someone's no longer willing to invest. Six of Wands. Somebody's not being noticed. I gotta go tell a kid to turn his TV down. Uh, Emperor. Emperor, Empress. If you want to build foundations with this, you need to, you need to say something. There might be some bad blood and someone maybe no longer willing to invest because there's been no communication. You gotta decide what you want and go for it or you don't get to rebuild. Give me Moonology on this for cancer, please. Moonology for cancer. 
You're going to make me pick one or you're going to give me one? You know what? I'm just going to take one. Prosperity lies ahead. <laughs> Believe in the impossible. Blue moon. Could have something to do with the moon cycle. Could have something to do with the new moon in Taurus. Maybe those are your windows. Okay. Pay attention to these moon allergies. The fates, number 17. One plus seven is eight. Eight is the number of infinity. It is the number of forward movement. Number 17. Fate, karma, acceptance that there are things you cannot change in knowing what those things are. Like, you can't rewrite history. Other people are who they are. You can't change them. The challenge is to accept them as they are and not try to make them otherwise to suit you. This is a time to look at how you attempt to mold people to fit your view of how they should be so you can remain in a relationship to avoid discomfort. What if who they are is whatever is happening between you and them is in the situation? Well, I gotta read that sentence again. What if who they are and whatever is happening between you and them in this situation is perfect from the perspective of spirit? Now is the time to accept what you cannot change, even if it means that you honor yourself, spirit, and the other person by moving on. Love unconditionally, for each of us is on our own journey, and we cannot direct that of another. Be aware that this relationship is indeed fated, and you are meant to evolve in a better version of yourself as a result of it. Okay, Cancer. I'm going to pause, clear the decks, tell a kid to turn his TV down, and I'll be right back with Leo. Okay, Leo. What does the universe have for you this week? Eight of Swords. What's that all about? up in your head about something you know that prison isn't real right you created that just throwing that out there oh my god it came out again injustice all right well justice is the challenge could be a libra Mm. Could be the universe getting in the way of something. Perhaps you're weighing whether or not something is fair. Throw a card on it in a second. Restless energy, heartbreak, and emotion. All right. I'm sorry. Give me two seconds. Sorry. The kid wanted junk food. Um. Okay. Looks like you just gotta, like, um, process the emotions you need to process and walk away from the crossroads of life the star and then you get to heal you need to allow yourself to heal all right what's this justice card all about unfinished business
King of Cups. You have unresolved emotions. You can't battle the universe. You realize that, right? It doesn't matter how you feel about it. Things have happened. Decisions have been made. Scales have been balanced. Now you need to balance your own scales. Stop trying to manipulate the situation if you're the one manipulating it. Okay? There could be some black magic crap getting involved here. Don't. Mm. What is done is done. It will blow up in your face. Okay? If it is not meant to manifest, it is not meant to manifest. Four swords reversed. Why are you restless? Why are you going to be restless? Why are you going to be restless? Did you miss someone you want out of the cold? There's a want to let go and to move on, but you're not doing it. Ace of Pentacles, you may have something to walk toward, but you need to get yourself unstuck. Why the Three of Swords? Talk to me about this Three of Swords. Death reversed. It's heartbreaking because you're not allowing a process to occur. Emperor, you're trying to control it. Stop trying to control it. Why the King of Cups? Why the King of Cups? Queen of Pentacles reversed. Why the Queen of Pentacles reversed? King of Swords. Okay, fine. It's okay to have emotion for it. It's okay to make a logical decision to not be emotional about it. But I don't know what this Queen of Pentacles reversed is all about. Is this your lack of self-worth? Or are you realizing that they're not worthy of you? It's sort of reversed. Either way, it's not going to kick off. But if you're in the mindset that it was... You that wasn't worthy, you need to get out of that. This had nothing to do with you. It's a whole lot of restless energy for nothing. Let's keep going. Why did it all happen? Why is this Ten of Wands reversed here? Why are the Ten of Wands reversed? Eight of Wands. Fast movement, fast communication. Acceptance of a situation, but not getting something off of your chest. I think you moved away quickly. Why the Ace of Swords reversed? Talk to me about this Ace of Swords reversed. Six of Wands reversed. No start, no victory. Seven of Wands. Three of Wands reversed. You couldn't wait for things to change anymore. Someone was combative. Someone had their rod up. Put yourself wherever you see fit. What's the Ace of Cups all about? Star reversed. You started a cycle before you healed. Chariots. Um, possibly you physically moved away from a situation. Or you put physical or emotional distance between a situation. Either way, you started something new without moving on. Four of Wands. You tried to build a foundation before you moved on. Six of Cups. Could have been a soulmate journey. Alright, let's talk about this Five of Cups reversed for the conclusion of this.
I see calmer energy between you, but I see you still not wanting to end it. Page of Swords. But I don't see you saying anything about it. I don't see communication there. Seven of Cups. Possibly you're going to keep exploring your options, which is as you should be. As you definitely should be. Tower. The tower doesn't spare anybody, guys. The tower's going to fall. The tower's going to fall. All you can do is process what happens after it. Don't fight change. Change happens for a reason. It happens for a reason. Could be something sudden and shocking involving a Scorpio coming up too. Give me one on that tower and then we'll move on to the last card. One on that tower. Towers aren't always bad. The Fool. Knight of Pentacles reversed. Lovers reversed. I knocked that out with my finger. We're putting it back. Okay. What you'd want to move isn't going to move. It's going to remain stagnant. But you have a new opportunity. One of your options is going to give a new opportunity. But you got to close this old stuff out first. Make a break, whether or not you want to stay at the crossroads. Give me one of those two of wands reversed. Page of wands. He's holding one wand with both hands, isn't he? He's not holding on to two different wands. Not knowing which one he wants to let go of. End of conflict, internal and external. New offer coming in. Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Guys. 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 <laughs> Moonology, please. Okay, well, she's going to have to wait a minute. Emotions are running high. Your dreams need a, need a practical plan. A win-win outcome and a forecast. The answers you need are coming. Your hard work is paying off. What do you need to release? Okay, pay attention to the moonologies. The universe just threw you a, a bunch of them. All right, one wisdom oracle. I'm gonna have to pause because I have another guest here. I apologize. Give me two seconds, honey. Who's with you? Who? Oh, okay. All right, give me two seconds. Sorry, guys. Poised and a change in the wind. I will do that reading as soon as I'm done. All right, a change in the wind. Relationships go through periods where partners seem out of sync with each other and stormy emotions and moods threaten to take down the ship. Perhaps someone has a change of heart and leaves. These rough seas offer opportunities for mutual growth. A way for you to understand your own heart and to know what well, you need to be truly happy. Rest assured that whatever is happening now, good will come from it. Take temporary shelter and remove yourself from drama. The air will clear and everything will be fresh and new again. This too shall pass. Number 48, poised. When you're confident and happy in your own skin, you're ready for deeper, more intimate relationships. You have nothing to prove right now. You're completely yourself and can handle anything. Love, relationships, and harmonious new connections are all present now or are coming in. You're ready to give and receive from your heart. This is a beautiful place to be. Friends. This is beautiful. All right. Clearing the decks. Going into Virgo. Okay, Virgo. What do we got going for Virgo? Two of Cups, Six of Pentacles reversed. It's new. It's different. It's amazing. It is uneven as hell. Let's see if they come back out. 
some of you are in a new connection. If it applies, if it doesn't, leave it. Y'all you may be given more than you're getting or vice versa. What do we got? Eight of cups. Nine of cups reversed. All right. All right. Let me put my foot up here. Ready to go forth and find your other two cups. But by the looks of things, the issue is giving up the cup, or making the offer, or taking the offer. The issue is the exchange, the communication. Not sure why. We'll see in a minute. Emperor, Four of Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune reversed. I feel like it's going to be the temporary closure of a door, but things ain't over. Betrayal. That's why you don't want to take the cup. Knight of Wands. Five of Swords reversed. Ten of Swords. There's some shady shit going on by, behind your back in the past. I, I'll be honest. I'd be a little bit afraid to take a cup too. I would. But you can't stay in that mindset. You can't. You just can't. Six of Wands. Queen of Wands reversed. Six of Wands, Queen of Wands. You gotta let go of the hurt. Queen of Wands reverse. She's jaded. She's angry. You gotta let go of that hurt. You gotta let go of that pain. You gotta let that cycle truly end. Page of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. Things are stagnant right now. There's no communication. There's no exchange. I'm not even gonna readdress this. This just screams... Player, 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 shady shit. We're just, we're leaving that alone. Talk to me about this Emperor reversed for Virgo. Talk to me about this Emperor reversed for Virgo. Five of Swords reversed. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, 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 okay. Humbling. Finally allowing the heartache to process. Finally walking away from that river of tears. But your attitude's still shitty. Why the four of pentacles? I don't sugarcoat anything, guys. If I'm offending somebody, I apologize, but I'm striking a nerve. Maybe that's got to say something to you. I say what I say out of love. I do what I do out of love. And if it pisses you off, I'm sorry. Sugarcoating it and making it all sunshine and rainbows doesn't help anybody. Two of swords reversed. You're going to inadvertently close a door, close yourself off to something, there's a lack of clarity. You're not going to jump. You're not going to jump. Why are you not going to jump? Alright, we have fortune reverse, tie. Thanks for coming to hang out. Seven, seven of Wands reversed. Okay, so you're going to be a little bit less combative. Realize that there's unfinished business with something. One on the Hierophant reversed. Oh no. Okay. You're not going to fight for it. You're not going to fight for it. You're going to let an opportunity pass you by. 
let something be unfinished and just totally isolate yourself from it because you've been hurt. So are you ready or not? You want to move forward and find those two cups, but you're not. You want to process those emotions, but you're not. I know it hurt. Dude, chick, whatever you're dealing with, insert whatever pronoun fits best, you got hurt. You were lied to. You're angry. Okay. Don't carry it around. Don't carry it around. You should just carry that into the next connection. That's not fair. That's not fair. And it's not fair to you to close yourself off with something that could potentially be beautiful because you're carrying around pain. Shake it off. Let it go. Don't carry it around with you. This is Six of Wands. Talk to me about this six of wands. This is somebody who wants to be noticed. This is somebody that's shaking their tail feathers in your face. Shaking their tail feathers in your face. Talk to me about this six of wands. Strength reversed. You might not be able to hold back. Possibly could be a little bit draining. Temperance, but this could be the connection that brings it together. This is two cups coming together, by the way. There they are. There they are. Could be could be a Leo, could be a little bit overbearing. Could be a little bit draining. Might be a little bit of an attention whore, but that's fine. Notice me! Oh my gosh, guys. <sighs> Hello? 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 <laughs> Make or break, Queen of Wands reversed. Are you going to allow yourself to stay jaded and closed off because you didn't get what you wanted from somebody else? Give me one. Share it reversed. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Nine of Cups reversed. I don't like this outcome. I need a moonology. Virgo, I love you. Don't do this to yourself, please. Please don't do this to yourself. You're worth more than this. The end of a tough cycle approaches. Bring love into the situation. We're leaving it. Wisdom Oracle. Give me a Wisdom Oracle. Whoa. Shit. Round and round. This one hit the floor. It might be important. Why? Round and round and why? Okay. Talk to me about round and round. The spiral quality of events when a lesson isn't quite integrated. Cycles, you are challenged to break. Revisiting a pattern from a new perspective. Honey, I think it's your cards throwing that out there. I'm gonna tip that down now. Oh goodness, you are wondering, how did you get, how did I get here again? 
Does something feel familiar right now in your dynamics with others? Maybe a little too familiar? Don't be surprised that you found yourself repeating an old story with the same sort of person who may not look similar, but who attracted you because of your easy acquaintance with his or her qualities. Your relationship is a mix of what is good and what is potentially challenging. You've been drawn to this person through the perfection of spirit's plan for your evolution. You may have circled back to an accustomed spot, a familiar place, but that's fine as you get to do things again, only differently this time. For you learned something of great value since the last time around. How will you choose to behave now that you're aware? Remain curious and stay out of the blame game. Hmm. Why? I ask myself that a lot. Why? I've learned to not ask why. Number 31. Motives driving intention, the power of knowing and the why. We don't always know why we engage in our relationships in the way that we do, mostly because our feelings aren't always logical. Now is the time to recognize whether you are being triggered by someone else or if your behavior is motivated by unresolved issues in the past. When you ask yourself, why am I feeling like this and why did I say that and spend some time to and spend some time in introspection, the answers may be surprising. Listen to the messages from your intuition, from the knowing deep within you. What does it tell you about yourself and others? In the end, life is all about being loved, miracles and deep understanding of your needs and how to get them met are the buried treasures of the why. Uncover them by posing the most powerful question you can ask yourself and your partner today. Why? Somebody needed that. All right. Once again, we are hitting pause and going to the next sign so you guys don't have to sit and watch me clear cards. All right. All right, Libra. Woo! Nine of Swords, a Tower, the Moon, and Temperance, and the Two of Swords reversed. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. A little much. Might be a story in it for somebody, so we're going to run with it. Anxiety. Things crashing down, lack of clarity. Temperance to a sword reversed. Huh. Wow. All right. I'm not going to spend too much time lulling over that, but it feels like there was a storm. And there was a calm after the storm and a snap decision. That it may not have come well in your favor, or you don't know the outcome of that snap decision yet, and you're anxious as hell about it. Either way, Libra, I'm proud of you for making a decision. My mother was a Libra. I got jokes. Just let it go. All right. Fool at the bottom of the deck. Still some anxiety. Anxiety came back out. 
Anxiety, honest conversations, and something growing. Could be personal growth. Could be the situation. Let me just... Things are coming together. Nobody's talking, though. Deep contemplation. After a conversation. Something not wanting to come to an end. Fought an ending. Seven of Cups, Ace of Wands reversed. Acceptance that if you choose a cup, whatever you want might not pan out. All right, let me just a little clarity on this. I'm starting to get tired, y'all. Just throwing that out there. I'm starting to get tired. I'm going at this for like hours now. Justice, the leveling of the scales. Who got something like this? Your pentacles reverse. Trying, trying to take a fair and honest approach. This has nothing to do with you, for starters. This isn't you. I feel like if the challenge is someone not communicating with you, it has nothing to do with you. Why the Nine of Swords? Really? Okay. Anxiety. No longer holding back. I feel like you're about to initiate a very intense conversation with somebody. Talk to me about the Queen of Swords. Oh, they're bad blood here. Is a tower again. Oh. And then it comes crashing down. There's temperance. There's always a calm after a storm. Always a calm after a storm. Clouds always part. Sun always shines again. Storms water the seeds we sow. Scatter them, too. Knocks things out of the way. Talk to me about Empress. Talk to me about the Empress. Emperor. Nice. Nice. Something's coming together. I feel like this might be divine. I feel like a conversation needs to happen. Give me one more on that emperor. Ha 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 ha. Two cups, two pentacles. Things coming back into balance. Why is it happening? Give me one on death reversed. The only thing I do not like about this is there's two twos here. I mean, somebody's got options. Queen of Swords reversed, death reversed. I at least see a calming between the two of you. I see control. I see personal growth. But for some of you, it could be the beginning of a divine union. And one more on this death reversed. Is 
Something came to a screeching halt. Communication could have been blocked. There could have been lies and deception. Either way, there's heartbreak. Death cycle didn't complete. Something did not end, so something new can begin. Page of Swords, one card. Five Pentacles reversed. Sometimes that Page of Swords tells you shit you don't want to hear. But he's honest. Something went stagnant. Somebody got restless. One more. Um, I'm going to take the double reversed. I'm going to take the five of cups reversed. I'm leaving the rest of it. Somebody? So things went stagnant. Disconnected from something potentially toxic, but you were restless about it? Restless. But not so restless that you were crying about it. This feels more like anxiety. Give me one more. Queen of Wands. Well, for some of you, that might be why you weren't so anxious about it. Or they won't, weren't so anxious about it. You're worth more than that. She's intuitive. Maybe you saw it coming. One on the hermits. One on the hermits. One. Oh my god. Okay. Whoa. Went inside and decided to not wait and not invest any more time. Okay. Okay. So that's why all this went down. That's super confusing, just throwing that out there. Well, at least you came to a decision if you've changed your mind five minutes later. Why is the seven of cups here? Why is the seven of cups here? This ain't over. This ain't over. I encourage you to explore other options. Accept the fate of the situation, but with those who reversed, I feel like you're going to end up revisiting this sooner or later. This is very weird. I'm getting downloads like popping off right now. Pop, 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 pop. This is probably the most confusing reading I've ever done. I see union, but I see choices. Are you the one who has choices? The one on this ace of wands reversed.
four of wands reversed at the bottom of the deck. Round and round and round, Libra. You gotta decide if you're jumping or not. Even if you go on the journey and you get there and the door is locked, you gotta decide if you're jumping or not. It's time to release negativity. Good, that's good sound advice. Show the world the real you. Also, sound advice. Buy the book. There's a knock at the door. Give me two seconds. I love Christmas. I love family. I love it when people pop over unexpectedly, and I love it when it takes me almost three hours to do something that I could normally do in like an hour and a half. Anyway. Mm. Buy the book. Getting along with others entails understanding and respecting who they have become as a result of their environment, culture, and experience. Find middle ground that allows the relationship to flourish while honoring the individuality of the other person. Play things by the book instead of trying to break the rules or pressure others to conform to the way you want them to do. Your connection will deepen as a result. Okay. Okay. Okay, fine. Good, 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 good. Okay. We're going to pause, clear the decks, and move on to Scorpio. Okay, when I was rough shuffling the clarification deck, the High Priestess Reverse popped out for you, Scorpio. I'm wondering if somebody's having a little bit of an ego wound right now, or someone isn't listening to their intuition, or someone's receiving some clarity. Hmm. Four Pentacles Reversed. Somebody might be letting go of something or unlocking a door. One of the two. We'll see what comes back out. <laughs> Give these a couple of good shuffles. I'm going to start changing decks in between, I think. Energies are kind of crisscrossed. I might have to light some sage when I start Sagittarius reading. All right. One more good shuffle. And to whoever who's going to sit through, like, over two hours of this, props to you and God bless you. You're amazing. All right. Nine of Pentacles, Four of Swords. Hmm, okay. You're embracing singularity. Your challenge is how long you're going to take a break. All right. I'm going to shut up and throw the rest of these cards down. See what they have to say before I say much of anything else. I might even wait for a little bit of clarity. Mm. Okay, you make or break because you're not going to have all the answers right away. Pat's not exactly going to be lit. Mm, why everything went down... King of Swords reversed, Seven of Wands reversed, Six of Swords. Moved on. That might have been a little bit of a rough conversation, possibly making you feel a little bit defeated. Maybe bringing back some inner demons. You moved forward. Okay. Alright. Well, that's cool. That's something new coming in. You can come out of a state of anxiety. 
Old cycles closing out, new coming in. King of Pentacles. Hmm. Embracing the new you, knowing your worth. Nice. I like it. I like it. I like it, Scorpio. You deserve it. All right, let's. Who do I want to address first? I want to address this Ace of Swords. What's coming in? What's coming in for you? Yes, I know it's low on disk space. And <laughs> What's coming in? A lack of clarity. Could be a Pisces. Give me one more. Mm, page of Swords. Ten of Swords. You're still taking a break. Are you ready? This is going to make you question if you're ready or not. Do one more on this page of swords. What's this little communication all about? It's the pentacles. Somebody might be making an offer. It's small, it's slow. A lot of communication back and forth. A lot of communication back and forth. Is it? <clears throat> Eight of Swords reversed. Eight of Pentacles. Two of Swords. Six. Oh, somebody is trying to get your attention! Chariot, forward movement, making a decision with clarity. Someone's trying to ease your mind. Someone wants your attention. Somebody's ready to invest. Are you ready? There's something painful that may not quite be over for you. So I feel like you need to take your time with this. Talk to me about the world. Talk to me about the world. Talk to me about the world. Ace of Wands reversed. Nice. Nice. One more. Sorry, Ace of Wands upright. Nice. Nice. Emperor. Very nice. Very nice. Give me one more. Give me one more. The world again. Somebody's ready. Somebody is ready. <sighs> Endings are coming. So no beginnings can happen. But they're willing to take their time. I feel like they're willing to give you what time you need for you to close whatever you need to close out. I'm not going to address this. I'm not going to. I feel like difficult conversations happened. I feel like maybe you were lied to. I feel like maybe it dredged up some seriously emotional stuff. All right, I'm going to throw just one card on it. All right, it's given me two. It left you hung up. And you walked away from it. You physically walked away, but you never emotionally or mentally walked away. You're embracing your singularity. You're in rest mode. You're finally to a point of being okay again. You're well on the, your way to this. You're well on your way to this. Talk to me about this three of pentacles. Oh my god, that's the lovers. Why did I think that was the three of pentacles? Probably because of the pentacle up top here. Hmm. Probably. Could be.
It's solid, but there's a choice to be made. So give me one on the lovers. Pentacles, Scream, Stability, Scorpio. Nine of Wands. I feel like you're going to wall yourself off to it. Because the path isn't lit. Justice reversed. Why? Three of Cups. Because you're not there yet. There's potential here, but you have a choice to make. Okay. I hit those with my thumb. They're getting put back. They're so getting put back. to release this burden. You gotta let go and let God. Yes, some unfair things have happened. Don't wall yourself off to something beautiful because you're afraid something's gonna repeat itself. One on that three of cups. You gotta let go of that pain. You gotta let go of that pain. You gotta let go of that pain. You gotta let go of that defeat. You have to let go of the deceit. You have to let go of the lies. Don't carry it with you. Why is the path not lit? Give me the moon. Give me one on the moon. Page of Cups. Hermit, Queen of Pentacles. Strength at the bottom of the deck. You have an inner demon you need to defeat. So if you need to go inside for a little while longer until you have the clarity that you need to take this cup, because there's that little bit of self doubt, fine. But don't let the self doubt stop you from probably what could be an extremely beautiful connection. Give me a moonology. Give me a moonology. A new romantic cycle begins. New moon in Libra. The energy is gaining momentum. The waxing moon. Pay attention to these. Pay attention to these. Orphaned, number four. Sorry, number five. I don't know why I said number four. Maybe number four is relevant. As you shift and evolve and commit to your own growth, you long for support but maybe disappointed and hurt by others who are not providing what you feel you deserve. Perhaps you are drifting away from this relationship because you're in a different stage of personal growth. Perhaps you're in a new relationship and discovering that you don't share the same values and beliefs. So you feel left out, unable to get to that intimate place of safety and belonging. Take heart as spirit knows you and loves you and will steer you in the direction of who's of, mm, of those who accept you as you are without artifice or agenda. Don't compromise yourself to belong. 
it won't be worth the price. Hmm. Okay. And clear the decks and read for Sag. All right, Sag. The Nine of Wands and the Queen of Cups came out as I was shuffling. Not quite sure why. Some of you might be walling off yourselves to receiving a cup, walling off yourselves to receiving love, or giving it. I mean, it could be one last go or one last try, but I feel walls. I feel walls. All right, talk to me. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Six of Wands reversed. Losing patience. I need clarifier on that Six of Wands reversed. So I'm going to shake up Tower, Nine of Wands reversed, Knight of Wands reversed, shake up, throwing in a towel, no communication, some coming to a dead stop, oh gosh, okay, Ten of Swords reversed, Death reversed, Three of Wands. Saggy, I'm a sad son, so I feel you, but why we do this? Why do we do this? I know. Pick up, dust off, move on. Not too quickly. Mm. Ten of cups. Three of swords. It ain't always sunshine and roses, is it? The hermit. Some of you need to go inside and do a little bit of introspection. Three of Cups decided it wanted to come out. I'm going to lay it right over here. We'll address that in a minute. New one on the Six of Wands reversed. The moon. Could be a Pisces, could be going into the unknown. You're losing patience, there's no clarity. I'm hearing stalemate. Stalemate. Someone's not noticing you. You're not noticing someone. Give me one on this tower. Possibly you're not understanding why someone isn't reciprocating something. The her Hierophant, Death, Ace of Swords. Okay. That's a shake up. Some new coming in. Of a cycle finally coming to an end that couldn't for a long time so something new can begin. That's sudden change. I don't feel like that's a bad tower. And the nine of wands reversed. One on the nine of wands reversed. One on the nine of wands reversed. One on the Nine of Wands reversed. I said one, not 20. We're going to try that again. Two of Cups showed itself, though. One on the Nine of Wands reversed. Don't like it. Can't decide. 
juggling, juggling, juggling walls coming down. Am I ready to let my walls down? Two of Cups. Something new coming in. Gotta decide if you want it or not. Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords. Truth, honest conversations. Knight of Pentacles. It's gonna happen slow. Possibly someone's pushing you to bring down some walls, or you're pushing someone to bring down some walls. Somebody else wants to move slowly. I can see where that Knight of Wands is upside down. Some, some tells me this that's about to go to a dead stop. Oh gosh, somebody's going to take something the wrong way. Queen of Pentacles reversed. King of Wands reversed. Dead stop. Something painful didn't end. You hung on to something. Somebody's hanging on to something. We're hung on to something in the past. One of this ten of swords reversed. Combative energy. Confrontation, combative energy, temperance reverse, negative energy, deceit, lies, negative energy, combativeness, there was fighting, there was squabbling, there was arguing, there could have been internal conflict going on. Six of Pentacles, somebody matched it though. One on death reversed, one on death reversed, that's an energy match. The Emperor, Six of Wands, Eight of Pentacles. Somebody tried to... I don't want this to be over. I want to keep investing in this. Pay attention to me! One on the Six of Wands. You're letting something go. You're letting something go. Whatever this was, it's coming to an end. And it's going to be sudden. You invested, and you invested, and you invested, and you waited. Shaking tail feathers. Like attitudes may have gotten involved. There was lies, there was pain, there was deceit. Why the three of wands for why it all happened? One of the three of wands, thanks. Five of cups reversed. You waited a long time to cross that river, didn't you? But you did. Eight of Cups, Page of Cups, all right, fine, I'll give my cup to this person, maybe this person wants it, I want one on that Three of Cups, I want just one on that Three of Cups, thanks, Four of Pentacles. Somebody never let something go. Somebody never let something go. Could have been a third party. That's why all this was happening. 
Oh, you're gonna do me like that? Well, I'm gonna do you like that. Just made a lever, let something go. I made it hard to move on. That's why this behavior is going on up here. Somebody's getting impatient. I don't know why you're not noticing me. Oh, they're noticing you. They're noticing. The path's not lit because the path's not lit. You weren't supposed to know. It wasn't supposed to be revealed until now. You need more time. You need more time, Sagittarius. You need more time. Talk to me about this Ten of Cups. Talk to me about this Ten of Cups. Nine of Wands reversed. There it is again. You want happiness, you want completion, but the wall's got to come down. The wall's got to come down. One more. Ten of Cups. You have to open yourself up to it, Sagittarius. I know you've been hurt. Three of Swords. Give me something on this Three of Swords. King of Swords. The King of Swords does not let his emotions run away with him. The King of Swords makes logical decisions. Six of Swords reversed. Magician reversed. Someone may come back trying to pull strings. Someone may come back trying to pull strings. But you need to move on. So whatever this was down here may try to come back. Notice me. Notice me. I'm ready to invest now. No. You moved on. You waited too long. You waited too long. Somebody come fill those cups. But it's up to you. Do what you want. Queen of Cups. Love yourself first. Do what's best for you. Do what's best for you. Give me a moonology. It's time to release negativity. Full moon in Scorpio. Saying, give him one more. Saying, give him one more. So I'm going to give you one more. Hold your vision, fixed moon. Nicely done. All right, get a wisdom. You know. You, observer. Four plus nine is thirteen. One plus three is four. Observer number forty-nine. Perspective, objectivity, neutral observation from a distance. Sometimes you just can't see the forest for the trees in the way. <laughs> Feelings can get all jumbled up, and often you hear one thing when a person says another. It can be like an echo of unresolved past experience dubbed over your conversation. Take time out before you react. It's likely the other person has no idea how his or her words affected you. Take a few steps back and lend understanding to situation. Have faith in your connection and trust that you can come together. Take to higher ground now. 
and cultivate curiosity about what you observe in yourself, in others, and in the landscape. You will find things much improved sooner than you know. Do 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 do. All right, all right. Wow, this was a long one. All right. Thanks for coming down and hanging out, guys. I appreciate it. Sorry it took so long, but messages got to come out, and I do things how I'm compelled to do them in the moment. So know that you are loved, be blessed, and I will catch you guys next week.